I slept a lot better in terms of energy. Sometimes I don't need to take coffee in the morning and I'm ready to go na. Hi everyone, I'm Dr. K. Sirius. You can call me Doc Casey. I'm a skin doctor, cosmetic surgeon, preventive medicine practitioner, and the founder of Luminous. Falls, overstrains, and bumps are common occurrences in sports, especially at the professional level, and sometimes results in the episodes of injury such as sprained ankles, twisted knees, and concussions. In today's skin vesting episode, we invited Mark a sports enthusiast to share with you his journey with SVF Stem Cell Therapy. Hi, I'm Mark Chess. I'm 41 years old. I'm a photographer and a sneaker vlogger. It started ever since I was young. Uh, you, will, you will always see me in the court or at the back of our house playing basketball, practicing. Then eventually, pag, as you grow old, ba, your love for sneakers grows. That's for me, that's what happened to, to me. And I kind of incorporated both. So that's why I review basketball sneakers a lot. Prior to this procedure, um, I had a, a knee strain and calf strain. So kind of affected the whole knee talaga. So, nag, Nag blue option, nag karona liquid inside the knee. So that's the recent injury that I had with my knee. My main line of work is actually photography. The stem cell can also help out in my field. Shempre, as a photographer, you have to keep on moving uh, all day standing. And shempre, a lot of um, wear and tear is a back, especially when you're older. So you will feel it, especially as a lower back pain. And hopefully, the stem cell therapy will help um, improve my energy and of course, regenerate the, the muscle tear that I have in my body. The initial feeling that I had was a little nervous at first, but thankfully, it was Dr. Casey who handled me because she was really calm from the start. She was always smiling. If you know Dr. Casey, parating na smile So very calm. So I think that helped out a lot and I didn't feel anxious before the procedure. Uh, I had um, general anesthesia. I didn't feel any pain during the procedure. Actually, I heard pa, na, na, na pa yung conversation nila. But eh. in terms of pain, no pain whatsoever during the procedure. The most common regenerative medicine treatments are platelet-rich plasma (PRP) and stromal vascular fraction, which is SVF. These two can be used to treat joint pain and inflammation. Both treatments use the body's own healing cells to promote tissue repair and regeneration. PRP is a platelet-rich concentrate that is derived from the patient's own blood, while SVF is a mixture of cells and other components that are derived from adipose tissue or fat. PRP is less complex and a choice for people with mild to moderate joint conditions, while SVF is best for moderate to severe joint pain, tissue repair, and regeneration. In recent years, numerous clinical trials and studies have investigated the safety and efficacy of stem cell treatments derived from SVF or fat. But what is SVF or stromal vascular fraction stem cell therapy? SVF is a short term for stromal vascular fraction. As I mentioned, it comes from adipose or fat tissue. Unlike other stem cells, it doesn't just fix damaged cells, it can also stop cells from getting worse in the future. Stromal vascular fraction is used for various clinical applications, including regenerative medicine, cosmetic and reconstructive surgery, hair growth promotion, and treating neurological conditions, pulmonary diseases, and Crohn's disease. And now, we were finally able to harness the power of stem cells through fats with Mark. Mark has been engaged with sports for a very long time. His bones, joints, and muscles are more exhausted than any other individuals, which makes SVF stem cell therapy a perfect go-to body for regeneration and healing. Because when an athlete is injured, their body's natural healing process can take weeks or even months. But with SVF stem cell therapy, it can help accelerate the healing process by providing the body with the cells it needs to repair from the damaged tissue. 
The procedure involves harvesting fat cells from the patient's body, usually from the abdomen or thighs. With Mark, I harvested around 100 ml of fats from his abdomen, then processed them in two phases. First is to isolate the stem cell using an adenizer. Adenizer is a mechanical device that is used to isolate stem cells from adipose tissue or fat. It works by using a series of rotating blades to break down the fat tissue and release the stem cells. The stem cells are then collected and can be injected into his knees to directly rejuvenate and heal the joints. Second is to isolate the stem cell using the automatic cell station, which is a stem cell machine, a device that is used to automatically isolate and process stem cells from adipose tissue or fat. It is a closed system that uses a combination of centrifugal force and gravity to separate the stem cells from the other components of the fat tissue. What I love about this technology is that the automatic cell station stem cell machine is that it produces a very high quality stem cells. The stem cells that are isolated by the system are very pure and viable. From this, 10 to 15 ml of stem cells are infused into his bloodstream via an intravenous IV drip, allowing it to travel throughout the body, which makes this procedure one of the revolutionary treatments here at Luminis. Aside from healing process, here are the few things I love about SBF stem cell therapy. Number one, it improves joints function and flexibility by repairing damaged tissue and stimulating the growth of new tissue. Number two, it also improves muscle strength and endurance by providing the body with the cells it needs to repair damaged tissue and build new muscle. And lastly, number three, this procedure has the potential to improve overall athletic performance by increasing range of motion and reduces the risk of injury. So what they told me is the peak of the stem cell therapy would reach from the third to six months. So if I wanted to para maintain the continuous regenerating of the muscles and repair of the body, uh, ideally, you could do it after the six month again, do the, the procedure para feel the effect a, a lot, lot more. For my overall experience for the procedure, I was really surprised and I'm not sure if it's the same with the other clinics, but for my experience in Luminis, I was really taken care of from the start, like um, following up on me for my uh, blood tests and stuff like that. Then after the procedure, um, the staff of Luminis was really always reminding me or always asking me if how I'm feeling. And even Doc Casey, I follow up on him kahit gabi na. Like how I'm feeling about my recovery. For the overall customer service that they gave me, it was quite an experience. And I would highly recommend it to my friends, especially to someone like me, like who wants to have longevity in, in their sports activity, in their physical activities. And plus pa yung ano, to look younger. So that's a plus and of course that extra energy boost that it will give you, I think if you can, it's highly recommendable. If you are considering this therapy, you should consult with medical professionals we have the credentials and experience in regenerative medicine and follow established safety and ethical guidelines. I hope you guys learned a little something from this episode of Skin Vesting. Before you go, don't forget to like this video, subscribe to this channel, and hit the notification bell if you want to learn more from me and from Luminis.